Hey. I'm seeing if it's working here. I guess so. I tried something and I guess I didn't have, uh, I learned something new. That's very interesting. I learned something about working with uh, Caster. That's cool. And let's get uh, Instagram going here. All right. Hi, Instagram. Hi, Facebook. Hi, YouTube. Hi, Zoom. Look at all my Zoom guys. There we go. Let me see. Uh oh, was Net was Nathaniel going crazy? Oh uh, yeah, thank you, Robbie Hewitt. Look at everybody. You guys are so enthusiastic. I gotta go to the main view. I want to see everybody. Oh, look at this. We have everybody go to gallery view. Hi, hi guys. Uh, I have I I see uh, cool Elijah, Kylie, Dace from England, Una, Robbie, Nathaniel from Zoom. The Fox Kids are here. And Isaac's here. There's Owen with you. Hey, Owen, your hair looks very, very enthusiastic today. Hi, Luca. How are you? And hi, Doug, Brother Bear. All right, I'm going to go back to my back to my speaker view. I'm just so glad to have you guys all here. This is my Mighty Monday class. And uh, what I'm doing for these final weeks before summer camp, before my, uh, before my summer Zoom art camps, is I'm inviting the world to join us uh, for our Mighty Mondays and uh, giving them a little sneak peek, a little promo, a little uh, in invite, invite, invitation to check out my Zoom summer art camps at markhisler.com. 14 weeks of these summer camps. All right, so let me, uh, let me welcome all my friends on YouTube and uh, let me check out, I got some fun drawings here. Yeah, let me check out my... Facebook. There we go. Now I'm going to start seeing the. All right. So here's what we did the last hour. We did the whale and the mermaid and the shark and a treasure chest. So we're going to be doing. Uh, we'll draw some more. Now, what where, where I got these ideas? This is back. <clears throat> I found this old sketchbook. I'm cleaning up my attic, and I found all these. Look at this. Look at this old old sketchbook from 2003. Look at this. I want to draw this 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 bat ray right here. And I want to draw the jellyfish and this fish. Look at this. And look at this. Let's start with this fish coming right at you. This is really cool. So let's take our drawing. And let's start with a fresh piece of paper. And I'll put that over there. And let's get going here. Put a dot in the middle of your piece of paper. And we're going to draw four squares. And I, uh, this one, this, this is a, this picture right here. You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to have in this square here in square number one, let me zoom this in so you guys can see what I'm doing here. I zoom this in and I'll zoom this one in here. All right. I'm going to move this camera just a bit. Now watch what I'm going to do right here in the middle. I'm going to draw this fishy guy here. I'm going to draw the circle, block it in, and then I'm going to draw the fishy's eyes. I'm going to draw this fishy's eyes, and I'm going to draw this fishy's mouth. I'm going to draw this fishy's, his mouth is going to be open. I used to scuba dive with my brothers off the coast of Catalina Island in, <coughs> in Southern California. And they had, Catalina Island had so many... Uh, of these uh, Garibaldi and, and clownfish. And they had these beaks that they really, they were so colorful, orange and yellow and uh, pink. And they had these beaks that were, that would, they would chew on the coral. So I'm going to make, get, give this fish a couple of these, this, this sharp beak. And I'll draw the, see, now I'm going to take my pencil I'm going to darken in the background. I'm going to make that really recess back in there. Thanks, Melody, for remembering to record. I always forget that. Glad you remembered there, Melody. So uh, uh, as far as the Zoom, guys, if you were on Facebook or Instagram, hi, Instagram. Great to see you. Hi, we have Glenda, 
Glinda on face on, on Instagram. I'm going to wave to people when they come on Instagram. Hi. And then here's uh, Melody on Instagram. There's Mr. Plots. Nice to see you, Mr. Plots. I'm going to try to keep up with that. And on, uh, on uh, hey, we have Monte Jennings on here saying good morning, Commander Mark. Hi, guys. He remembers me from this old TV show, The Secret City, right there. All right, so we're going to. We're drawing this. Uh, put that uh, the back, the uh, the contrast, the value, darker value, and I'm gonna draw this fish's eyes up here, and I'm gonna draw. Now take your eraser. Let's let's clean that up. Let's clean up, clean up, clean up, and then well, look at Ken Anderson's on, and he's wait, uh, wishing Veronica a happy belated birthday. Well, Veronica, when was your birthday, Veronica? When was your birthday? Happy belated birthday to all of us. From all of us. To all of us, too, I guess, huh? All right, here, put that, put the contrast in there. <coughs> and, uh, okay, oh, come on over here. Now, watch this. I'm going to take this. You want to pull your chair over here? And uh, here you go. Draw. I'm gonna draw this the fish's fins. You can just. I gotta. My son's here. Hi, Mario. And he is time for his eye drop. So I'm gonna do. I'm do. I'm multitasking here. Here he comes. He's gonna get over here. And there you can see my Mario. They can see a little bit of you on the. On the um, camera there. All right. Here we go. Come on up here. <coughs> here we go. All right. Scoot on in. There we go. There we go. Keep it closed just for a second there. Here you go. He hates when I say that. He just, he does not like me to tell him to keep his eyes closed. But he's back there, Mar. You're, you're in there. We have it on the, we have it on the camera. Me, you, you and I doing to you and your eye maintenance. There we go. Thanks. Thank you, Momo. Yep. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks, Momo. All right. Now up here, way up high. I'm gonna put the dorsal fin of this fish here. So you know the cat's right by you. Yeah. Now, on this one, I'm going to put some bubbles coming out of his. Look at this. I'm going to put... I know the fish don't have bubbles, but I'll put bubbles on this guy. Now, I'm going to do... I'm going to do something kind of fun. Uh, this reminds me of this book right here. I did this drawing where... I'm trying to remember. Where where was this drawing? Where I have... I have... I, I drew the fish... Coming right at you and had coral reef. Let me see if it's in here. There it is. I did that that fishy right there. And that good. That was in my cartoon draw 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 cartoon animals fish. <coughs> now on this one, I want to do something. I want to have I want to have the corner of the fish down here. And then I'm gonna draw this fish's eye. And all you see. <clears throat> All you see is, um, you see this, actually, you know what, this fish is going to be, I think what I'll do is I'll have this fish, he's going to be co coming out of the, the page here. See the square? All right, so I'm going to put, I'm going to put his side fence, and look at this, he's, he's, see that square here? Isn't that fun? And I'll move that up just a bit. Isn't that cool? So I just I want to have this fish really close, and on and on this one, look, I'm going to give this fish some teeth. You see, he's coming over here. He's popping out of the drawing. See, we're illuminating that. We're making that fish look like he's popping. I'll put some wrinkles under his eye. And he's going to be looking over at this fish a little bit. Leave a little reflection. 
darken that in. Isn't that cool? So we have this guy coming over here. And we'll darken this in. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put some fish scales on this, these guys. I think I'll put some fish scales. I love adding little details. Extra, extra details. I put some little details on that one. Let me zoom this one out just a bit. And that looks cool. Now, let's darken in. Put, let's put that. Let's go in here and let's put that uh, that value. And then underneath here, look, I'm going to put a shadow where this fin comes out. That fish comes out of the box here. <clears throat> That's kind of cool. Then I'm going to jump right to my uh, my blending stump. Watch this. I'm going to dip my blending stump into the dark mouth, and I'll use that to add some tone, some value. See that? I'll, I'll dip it. I'll dip it like a paint palette. I'll dip it into the the mouth, and I'll put a little value under the eye. A little value under the eye here. How are you guys doing on the Zoom? Uh, is that better? Can you see it better now? How are you guys doing on the Zoom? Let's, uh, give me a one through five up there on the, with your fingers. Okay. Thanks, guys. Isaac, I love your enthusiasm, but don't go nuts and, and, uh, um, spam the chat box because then I, I can't see all the comments. But I love your enthusiasm. I love it. I love that you gave me a nine million nine hundred zillion gazillion billion million zillion. Kind of <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, hey, Mary Curtis is saying hi to Mario. Look at this. Well, he hello, a April eighteenth. Uh, well, that was one day. Well, happy birthday from one day ago. I'm glad. Uh, glad you're with us today. <clears throat> All right, it's break time. I gotta wet my whistle. I gotta calm my cough. Hold on. Let's do a student art gallery. I want to see how you did on your little ocean drawing of the fishies. Melody's going to grab a bunch of different students and put them up there. Now, we're going to do a program tonight at 6.30. Just remember that, and I'll be on uh, YouTube. Nice job, Luca. Nice job. But go ahead and show all the... So everybody's drawing. There's the Fox Kids. As I wish you guys on YouTube and Instagram and Facebook could see these great drawings. I'm seeing these. These are so great. If you guys on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube want to have a, <clears throat> a Zoom link. Hey, Robbie Howitt. Good to see you. If you want to join Dace and Ruth and Mateo and Isaac and Elijah and uh, Fox Kids and Robbie and... Uh, Melody and Una and Ruth. If you want to join us next week, I'm going to send out the Zoom link to everybody that's on our ma email mailing list. And the way you get on the mailing list, you guys, is you go to my website. Let me show you. I'll show you how to get on my mailing list. You ready? I'm going to close this. I'm going to now watch what I'm going to go to markkisser.com. So there it is. Go to markusser.com. Now watch what happens. See, it pops up right away. It says, join our mailing list. <clears throat> so you, you join the mailing list, and you and we'll send you a, a free Zoom link. I just want to show you something really cool, something new we've added. See this piece of art right here? This was a special limited edition of Mount Rushmore, autographed and donated by artist Mike, uh, Michael Calero. And uh, he donated these, and I just want to show you. Isn't that cool? The, the icons of the 1980s with Bob Ross and me, Commander Mark, LeVar Burton, and Mr. Rogers. Isn't that wonderful? So that's just that's just a neat, neat, neat thing we've added. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now, if you uh, but if you want a free Zoom link, you guys, good job up there, everybody. Uh, send me an email. Uh, sign up for my email, and we'll send that to you. Oh, Monte sees the Emmy over my shoulder. Yeah, I just happen to have it within arm's reach right here. Gee, how 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 uh, um, how modest of me to have my Emmy right here. If you don't know what an Emmy is, it's a TV. It's a like a bowling trophy for TV people, and it's given to you by the National Academy 
of television arts and sciences. And so in the TV world, I'm pretty cool because I have an Emmy back here. Marty, that was, <clears throat> that's funny that you saw that. I just happened to have it within arm's reach of me. All right, so let's draw this cool clam. I'm going to put two dots. I'm going to put two dots. And this is actually a drawing. This is actually a drawing from my Imagination Station book here. I've written a bunch of books on drawing. Uh, 14, I believe. I number changes every week. I keep going. Oh, 15, 14, I mean 13. <clears throat> Excuse me. So let's see. Cool clam. Now this is a drawing. Uh, have you guys ever heard of the Penny Arcade? Uh, let me if, raise your hand. Have you ever heard of Penny Arcade? Anybody? The guy who did Penny Arcade is uh, when he was a kid. He's a like this successful animation cartooning billionaire now. But he did the uh, Michael Mike Krahulik. He did the inking in this book. But uh, let me find Cool Clam here. I gotta find it. It's such it's, it's a neat picture. Um, I'm gonna find it real quick. I'll go through the. There's there's a lot of good stuff in this one. There's a lot of great ideas in there. There it is, page eighty one. This is a great one right here. Now this is on Amazon. If you like this book, this is on Amazon.com. We're gonna draw that cool clam with the tongue sticking out, with little fish guys swimming. So we'll draw. Let's draw that. Now I'm gonna draw very lightly. Now I'm gonna combine a couple things on this one. I'm gonna come down here and draw the bottom of the clam, and then let me zoom this in. Now I'm gonna use. Uh, I'm going to go to my other book. You can draw in 30 minutes. Do I have one up here? I don't have a... I have a great drawing list in my book. You can draw in 30 minutes, but I don't have one of those up here. So, but it has the... It's another clam lesson. I love the clams because it's a good lesson for drawing for short. And put a dot right here. What we're going to do is I'm going to draw... I'm going to draw this very lightly. I'm going to draw that that top of the clam here. See, I just draw all scribbly and loose. Be very comfortable. Be relaxed. Give yourself the license to flop, you guys. Give yourself the license, the creative license to step out of your comfort zone. You've got to fail to succeed. It's okay to make mistakes, okay, guys? Stress is on the bus. Stress is on the bus. Beep, 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 beep. Stress is like, look at, I'm watching you guys. I'm watching you drawing. I'm watching you genius artist. I've got my eye on you. All right. Now, for this clam here, I'm going to draw this kind of a, draw that wiggly edge of that clam's body there. The clam's, let's draw this clam. Draw the top of the clam. Now, down here, I'm going to make the clam kind of sinking in the mud. So I'm going to put a big, lump of sand right here another lump and a big lump and a small lump and then over here i'll put a big lump and a tiny lump see variation variety not the same on both sides so i'll draw this this clam here it's sinking sinking there sinking in the sinking in the sand all right now down here i'm going to put should i put, i think i'll put should i put his eyes up here i think i'll put the clam's eyes up here I'll draw the near eye right here, and using some overlapping. And look at you can see his tongue inside here. I think I'm going to draw his tongue. There's his tongue here inside. Should we put a pearl on his tongue? Should we put a little pearl? So I'll put a little pearl, and he's like yum yum yum. I'm going to put a little pearl on his tongue. Isn't that fun? And then take your pencil. Wherever you have those uh, overlapping lines, those those uh, lines that, those blocking in lines, see those extra lines, just clean up, clean up, clean up, put some wrinkles here. Clean up, clean up, clean up. Isn't that fun? All right, to, uh, we have, we have uh, 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 Lydia. Hi, Lydia. Hey, Robert Newstead's on Instagram. Good to see you. Uh, hello, Robert Newstead. Good to see you. Glad you're here with us. 
And we have uh, Aiden Smith on Instagram. Hi, I should wave to you guys. Hi, Robert Newstad. And then hi, Lydia. I haven't been waving. Hi, Sam. I'm going to wave to Cynthia. I'm going to wave to uh, Closington. Good to see you guys. I, thank you for joining me on Instagram. I just changed the focus. Sorry about that. All right. I know it's kind of cricket. I, it, I, I do my best. Instagram, you have to use your phone. That's kind of an interesting challenge. Um, but on YouTube and Facebook, I'm glad you're here. Uh, Veronica, good job. I would love to see that. Now, here we go. Now, again, if you guys are wanting to join me for my live Zoom next Monday, if you want to be me to see your camera like Isaac and Owen, Owen, Owen's having a snack. You're going to share it with everybody, Owen? No. And uh I'm gonna draw the I'm gonna draw the clam looking over his shoulder, put a little reflection in his eye. I love leaving that little reflection on the eye, that little nuance here. Let's draw that, and then I'm gonna darken up underneath that clam underneath that lip, dark up underneath here, and get lighter as it comes down. This is blended shading. And dark up underneath there. And then, now this, I don't like how that came. This one has to be a little more like that. There we go. I'm going to shade the little edge of the pearl. And then take your pencil. This, this is all in the shading here. A lot of shading. Shade inside here, away from the sun. And get light as you come out. Isn't that wonderful? Lighter, lighter, lighter. Lighter, dark here. Lighter, lighter. Do you love it, love it, love it? Shade it. Now, wherever the light is, we're shading opposite. So I'm going to have my, my sun streaming from the top right. And I'm going to... I'm going to blend this. See that? I'm going to blend it lighter as it comes across. See, I love putting things in the sand like that. Now back here, let's draw this, the ocean floor, kind of a, 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 a jagged line back here. And oh, look, I'm going to have, I mean, here's, here's Ariel the mermaid. I'm going to draw Ariel the mermaid here. Here's Ariel. Here's Ariel. She's, she, there she is. You can see her. There's Ariel. There's her fan. There's her beautiful hair. And she's just... There's her hair. Look how long her hair is. She's singing. You can see her little singing. La, 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 la. She's, there's Ariel. And then, oh, look. Look. There's a giant shark chasing Ariel. Oh, no. Oh, Ariel, there's a big sharky chasing you. And there's sharks coming, Ariel's going, la, la, la! So Ariel puts on the turbo thruster, and the shark back here is following Ariel's, saying, Ariel, why are you screaming? I just want to play Monopoly. There's the shark here, little silhouette. Ariel, let's play Monopoly. There we go. And then now, to make this look a little more uh, oceany, put this value along the bottom and then get it lighter. A little bit of darkness right along the edge there. And it sets that background apart. See that? Put it nice and dark along the base here. And get it lighter as it comes up here. Looking good. Hey, we have Dr. Dr. Ames here. Looking good. Ariel is practicing social distancing. That's right. They're practicing. They're being safe. I, that's funny. That's good. That's correct. Thank you, and Miss Inst Mr. Instagram Responder. All right. Well, there you go. There's our second drawing. Take a look at our drawings here. We have uh, we have our fish coming out of the drawing. We've got our cool clam that's kind of burping here. Burp. Put some bubbles. Burp. 
Put some bubbles there. Now let's see how we're doing on this drawing. That looks cool. All right, moving on to uh, another drawing. You know what I'm thinking of? In this book, in my new book, You Can Draw in 30 Seconds, which I really hope you guys all order. This is such a great book. And if you, this is two pounds, it's 200 pages. It's my 15th book of drawing. I have over a million books in print. Ooh, impressive. I'm totally trying to impress you. Ooh, over a million books in print. And this book is so packed full of great ideas. The way you order this book, you got to go to my website. This is self-published. You can't get, like this book right here, My this is my best-selling book. You can draw in 30 days. This book right here you get from Amazon, right? You can get that one. But on this one, it's self-published. So you have to go to my website there. It's at the bottom of your screen. It's markkistler.com. And for a limited time, for a limited time, for this month, um, if you order my book, you don't have to pay the $50 uh, for an autograph. Just buy the book. It's $20 plus shipping. I'll autograph every book order, okay? So I hope you guys order it. What I'm going to do is I want to draw the, the starfish lined up. And uh, Melody, do you know where that starfish lesson is? And if you have the book, uh, how many of you have the book out there? Raise your hand if you have my book. I'm trying to find the starfish. That there, there, there's a good one. Look at the little uh, penguin, penguin eating pizza. There's such great ones. I think it's in the lesson twelve with the tree roots. Let me see. I got to go to the very end here. Uh, there's the tree root lesson. I'm looking for. Ooh, the squid. That's a cool one. Look at the. Let's draw the squid. Here, I was going to draw the starfish, but I'm going to draw that. Let's draw that squid. That looks cool. All right, so we're going to go to page 173, and you can draw in 30 seconds. And we're going to draw that squid. Now, I got to get something heavy. Got to get a piece of wood here. I got to hold this open, so I got a block of wood to hold my book open so I can see it. All right, so we're going to draw we're going to draw that squid. This will be cool. Let me move this down here. And I'll zoom this one in. I'm going to work on this. I guess I'm jumping to score number 4 because it's just easier with the the book. And let's go this one. All right, so we're going to draw this cool squid. I'm going to draw the squid kind of slanting back here. And this is a variation, page 173 from You Can Draw in 30 seconds. So I'm going to draw this, this squid with his legs are going to be foreshortened on the ocean floor. So I'm going to block in the squid. I drew the, the, I drew the direction. And then look at this. I'm going to draw the first leg. It's going to be foreshortened. A lot of these, a lot of the legs are going to be in that foreshortened circle. My boundary, my, I'm sketching, I'm blocking it in here, see? So I'll take I'll take this first leg and I'm gonna draw the the squid's first leg coming down here. There's the first leg. And then back here, look at this this other leg. This other leg is stretching out. It's really stretching out. It's like it's reaching out there. See that? I'll zoom that out just a little bit so you can see. And then I'm going to have one leg. This leg's going to be coming over here. Foreshortened. I'm staying within this foreshortened circle kind of shape here. See? And then I'll put another leg back here. And I'm going to have this one. That one changes direction a couple times. You see this? So this one's going to be coming down. Thinking of direction southeast, southwest. We're using those drawing direction compass. That's a really important idea. And this is a chart that's in the back of the book. Our drawing direction compass. Lines that go in direction southwest and northeast, southeast and northwest. Very, very important. So then, then I'm gonna take I'm gonna take another, I think I'll take this arm, and I'll have this one. I think he's going to be waving. He's up here. He's like, you who The uh, uh, squid has eight legs, right? Like the octopus. I'm going to draw the eyes. Draw the eyes right here. 
draw the eyes of this guy. I'm blocking him. I'm sketching in. And then I'll take my eraser and I'm going to start cleaning up wherever there I know that he, these lines overlap. Clean up, clean up, clean up. Clean up. And then I think I'll take this line. I'll take one more leg here. And I'm going to have, I'm going to draw that leg kind of curving up. See, we got, we got to fit, we got to fit eight legs on here, right? So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, two more legs, two more legs. So back here, I think I'll take, I'll take one leg and I'll have one leg come in front of his head here, like he's wiping his brow. So there's one leg. Well, we're getting a lot in here. So how many legs do we have here? Hey, in, in, uh, the squid has 10? Really? Does the squid have 10 legs? I didn't know that. I thought it had eight like the uh, octopus. Melody, fact check. How many legs does the squid have? Send it to me. Boy, we're going to, some of them are going to be hidden back behind here. I'm going to, you know what I'm going to do on this leg here? I'm going to make this leg a little bit longer. Yeah, you know what I'm going to do here on this leg? Watch this. I'm going to. I'm gonna make this leg longer, and it's gonna it's gonna pop over. See that? Look at it went over that leg. Ooh, I love it. Because if we take a look again at this, uh, let's look again at the, this is a uh, embellishment. It's a variation embellishment on this page. That's that's the the drawing that we're doing right there. See that? Using the the drawing directions, isn't that fun? So that's from page one seventy three here, and I'm going to draw his eyes. I think I'm going to give him give him some squid eyes. Look at that, and ten for squid. All right, this is an octopus. Because the squid has a diamond shape too to head. So this is this is an octopus. Octo for eight. Look at that. I just changed midstream. Squid, 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 octopus. All right. All right, now here, draw the eyes. Are they are they in the same family of species? I wonder. Look at that up. That would be uh something you guys can do all kinds of Google search and get great information about. These guys now, on uh, before I darken it, I'm going to put his little suction cups underneath, underneath this guy. Put those little uh, suction cups, four shorts in circles, right? They put little thicknesses. Isn't that fun? Are you loving it? And then down here. Put some more foreshortened circles down at the bottom. That's fun. Now remember, uh, coming up very, very soon, in uh, less than five weeks, we have my summer art camps. Go to my website at markkistler.com. Go to my website. It's at the bottom. And check out all the different dates and check out all the times. It's going to be so awesome. It's going to be so awesome. I have so many different themes. So many different themes and dates. 14 weeks. Can you believe that? Now look, I'm going to I'm see I just love adding the detail. Take your time and add this fun wait till we shade if you think this is cool. I did a really fun squid and now in draw3d.com, these are I'm going to show you some drawings from draw3d.com. This right here, by the way, it's 500 lessons. Here's a few of them. I did these shark lessons. I just want to show you this squid that I drew. I got to find it. Uh, these are all from the draw3d lessons. There's the ginger. These are so cool. These are lessons that I did on uh, draw. These are all on draw3d.com. Here it is. Here's the squid I wanted to show you. Look at that squid uh, wrapping around the toes. Do you love that? So if you guys want to want a great you want a great uh membership if you don't have time to come to my summer camps, check out my draw 3D membership. It has 
hundreds of drawing lessons. Here's a 50% off code right here. Little secret code for you choose the one year membership from draw3d.com. Draw3d.com. Choose the one year membership. Check it out. 50% off. Has hundreds of lessons. Plus, you get access to my Mighty Mondays. And you get the, the Zoom. Let's do a student art gallery on Zoom. Melody, can you can you have all those? Hey, look at the doggy. Owen's doggy. Hello, doggy. Let's see here. Grab. There's uh, Luca's drawing. Hi, Luca. I'm glad that you're out here. There's Luca's drawing. Melody's going to add some more. Hold up your drawings so I can see how you did on these. There's Fox Kids drawing. There's Isaac's drawing. Hi, Isaac. Great to see you. There's Robbie's drawing. I wish you guys on YouTube and Instagram and Facebook could see these kids' drawings. There's Days from England. Hi, Days from England. There's Una. Good job, you guys. And there's awesome, cool Elijah. Nice drawing. And Melody, you're going to show your drawing? What about Nathaniel? Can we get Nathaniel up there? You go ahead. Once they show it, you can... You can drop the the and then add more. There's Mateo. Hi, Mateo. Your drawings are looking good, Mateo. And then let's get Luca's uh, drawing up there. Let's get Luca's drawing up there. There's Nathaniel's drawing. Oh, I wish you guys could see these drawings. They're so great. And there's Luca's drawing. That's back to me now. Well, I'm gonna put some more. Look, I'm just. I love the detail, you guys. I love adding the detail to my drawing. Love it, love it, love it. Love it, love it, love it. Someone type in detail in Instagram. Someone type in detail. Uh, oh, that look at here. Now I have some an interesting information from from Azimple. Azimple, she wrote, most squid. I'm reading this sideways, by the way. Most squid have a total of 10 arms, with eight of them being relatively short tentacles and two of them being much longer. Interesting. Interesting. Thank you for being my fact checkers. And uh, this is, oh, William has my book. Thank you, William. Thank you for getting my book. You can draw in 30 seconds. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a wonderful book. If you guys don't have it, order it from my website. I self-published it. I self-published it. <laughs> Love to have you guys on there. All right, so I'm gonna put I'm gonna put some more. I love these details. Wait till we add the shading. If you think this this is cool. We're gonna add some shading here. It's gonna really make it look 3D. Coming around here. Now, remember, look what I did on this one. I put this background. See that background back there? Isn't that cool? See how that background really, really pops it out? And uh, using overlapping here and having the, the squid arms. Look at this. I just love adding this detail. All right. Love it, love it. Now, this along the ground, let's put a shadow. I'm going to put a shadow, cast shadow underneath this arm. See that? I'll put a little shadow underneath that arm. And then down here, I'm going to take my time on this one. I'm going to put a lot of shading and shadow. Put that shading and shadow down here. Isn't that fun? Do you love it? Shade it light as it comes across here. Lighter, lighter. Look at put put the shadows. Put the shading. Shading, shading, shading. Put this. I'm going to put the cast shadows. You see how that really will set that octopus on the ground? Put that cat. And the cast shadows are coming down. I'm using the drawing direction compass. See, 
coming down in direction southwest. Do you see that? All right. I missed some text messages on my Zoom. Let's see here. Uh, detail. That's right. I love adding detail. And Robbie, Robbie, you're funny. Don't don't you? You guys don't have to don't have to monitor the text box. Melody will do that. You funny guys. I love your enthusiasm, but you just let Melody. Melody's the chat box supervisor. Okay. But thank you for for trying to help. Thank you so much. But stop it. Thanks so much. You're so cool. Stop it. Thank you. You guys being so helpful. Stop it. Here, put the shadow. Put the shadow. All right, now time to shade. Let's shade. I'm going to put a little cast shadow over that. Wherever, wherever the legs overlap, it's cool. See that? Take your time. Get your pencil in there. Get that shading. Isn't that fun? Look at how that's... Notice how I don't want to have the same value for my shading on the legs as I do for the shadow. You see, I want to have a little different value. I'm going to leave the section cups white. I'm not going to shade the section cups. But I'm going to shade the legs around the section cups. Boy, there's quite a long delay on uh, my Facebook page. Wow, a long, the long day. Yeah, there's a one. There's a, I see William saying about the eight legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, the eighth leg is hidden. You can, you can't see it. It's hidden. It's in. It's a mystery. No, there's actually two. Yeah, it's octopus. That's right. We decided an octopus. All right, so I'm gonna blend it. Look, I'm taking my pencil. I'm gonna get the shadow under the eyes. Isn't that fun? I'm gonna put the shadow here on the on the head. Look at this. I'm gonna put a little shadow that's cast that's cast on the on the the uh, the head of the octopus, and then darken in the edges, shade it lighter as it comes up. You guys having fun on this one? So that was that was a really cool lesson, you guys. I'm going to put our title now. I'll put our title sheet. Let's put. I'm going to put the uh, our title here. It's Mark Kistler. That's me, Mark Kistler. Yeah, who? Mark Kistler's live Zoom Mighty Mondays, and I want to thank all you guys on YouTube for joining us, and on Instagram and Facebook. Mighty Mondays. If you want to be on our Zoom for Mighty Mondays, go to my website and click the uh, that little pop-up that says join our e email list. And I'll send you a Zoom link next Monday. Mighty Mondays. Mighty Mondays. Now, this is um, our 11 a.m. class, Central Time. Our date today is April 19th. 2021 and this is week 36 36 weeks we've been doing this 36 weeks of 41 so we have about four or five more weeks five more weeks until summer comes up there we go and uh that's it sign your name to your drawing sign your name put your date on it and there's our that was a fun lesson there. Thank you guys so much. Let's do one more round robin. Melody, can you do one more round robin? I want to see everybody's drawings. And let's do a round robin art gallery. Una, so let me see your drawing, Una. Oh, I see you have a oh, you have your kitty cat going there. Here's Fox Kids. Ooh, I love your squid, your octopus. Luca, nice drawing, nice background. Owen, excellent drawing. Isaac, look at these. Drawings, these are incredible. Nice. I like the shading. I like the the eyes. I like how you put it. Isaac put a triangle head. He made a squid with ten legs. There's Robbie, Mr. Smile, Mr. Million Watt Smile. And there's Dace from England. Hello, Dace from England. How are you? Are from Norwich, England. So great to see you. You've been drawing with me for a long time. 
All right, guys. Well, thank you, everybody, for drawing with me. You're wonderful. You're awesome. You're amazing. I'm going to uh, save that recording. Would you, <laughs> would you save that recording to all my... Uh, and go ahead, all you guys on uh, on Zoom, thanks for drawing with me. I love you. I love you. Bye, Zoom. You guys are great. I'll see you guys for uh, tonight at 6.30. I'm doing another lesson at 6.30, okay? There, there's my Instagram. I'm going to, I got to turn off Instagram. Um, Zoom, I'll see you at 6.30 if you want to come tonight at 6.30. That's our next class. Bye, guys. All right. And I'll say goodbye to... Instagram. Goodbye, Instagram. In now. And we'll share it to IGTV. And I'll say goodbye to Facebook and YouTube.